fans of the cable program Degrassi The Next Generation showed up at Spring Hill Mall in West Dundee earlier this month to meet stars of the show. The appearance was the only one in the Midwest before the show's October 1st season premiere. The end, they've actually been really good about putting on events to connect directly with the audience. Um, since we produce in Canada, we're sort of been a little removed from the people here and from the teens. But as a network that's specifically targeted for teens, they've done a lot of outreach activities for them, from their website to special screenings for season premieres to a mall tour. It just seemed to make sense to connect with teens exactly where they like to hang out in the summer. I've been on the show for three years now, and as the seasons, as we start filming more seasons, I learn more and more about myself and my character, and I find so many similarities. I think, honestly, be, uh, playing a character like Paige has made me come out of my shell a little bit, just because she's a very um, confrontational person, and I'm not like that at all. I think teenagers can relate to the show on so many levels. Our show is a drama dealing with controversial issues that teens deal with today, and I, I don't know, like, we're not all models. We don't look perfect all the time. Some of us have bad skin. Like, it's realistic. The topics that are dealt with and the way it's done. It's not, it's not corny, it's not cheesy. I knew how popular the original show was, but this has just been phenomenal. Like, I don't think any of us ever expected this to happen. This is just a new fan fan base for us. And we've been doing mall tours and like going to screenings all across the US. And it's so exciting, especially because we're in a different country and we're, we're meeting all these kids who look up to us and love the show. And I don't know, it's crazy. The fans in Canada treat it. Um, they don't get as excited as the kids in the States. I think it's just because it's a Canadian show. The first episode this season um, continues the date rape storyline that my character had. And yeah, it does exactly that. It brings some closure to the story. And I don't want to say too much. Don't want to give it away. Season four, I'm confident season four is the best season yet. Um, it's so dramatic, so intense. People break up, people get together. There's um, violence and a lot of dealing with self-issues and self-confidence. Uh, teen issues and self-confidence and it's a really great season.